In this video I want to show you how you can open notes on your iPad in split view. Means how you can open two notes in parallel side by side and work on both of them at the same time. First I show you a couple of ways how you can open notes in split view. Then two use cases and finally how you can drag and drop tasks between days, weeks and regular notes. Okay, let's jump right in. You can open the sidebar of your, of your regular notes and there simply long press a note and you will find a new option called open in split view. If you tap on this, obviously it opens it in a split view and this is a new uh, complete main window. So you have another sidebar here and you can switch to any other note you like from here to daily notes, weekly notes or even search and filters. And um, also you can drag and drop between those notes from the right to the left and back. And uh, you can close this window uh, by tapping on these three dots at the top. And also here you see at the bottom options to open more new windows. And right now we have the stage manager deactivated, but I show you uh, how it looks like when you activate the stage manager as well. So let's close this and open. Uh, so this, this, this was a regular node. Let's open a daily node. You can simply long press a day in the calendar and you get the same option to open it in a split view. And this will uh, change the view a little bit because there's less space. It will show you the calendar strip at the top, like just like on the iPhone, so you can switch between those days. And if you have enough space, it will give you the, uh, side, the calendar sidebar on the right here. And in this view, there's still not enough space, so it will open it uh, as a couple, uh, as an overlay sidebar so you can open it switch to a day and then go back to the node and let's close this again and if you have the full screen view you can keep the sidebar also opened all the time so these are the different ways you can open it. you can also open the weekly notes by long pressing in just the same way and you can open which is interesting you can open um, search results in a split view so let me open this filter here test filter now I can uh, long press the first result, for example, and open the node where this result lives in a split view and will scroll to the result and highlight it as well. So you can keep the search opened on the left. Okay, let's close this again and go back to our original node. And you can activate the stage manager and now also resize the window and open other windows from the sidebar just the same way. This allows you a couple of more ways to resize your windows or open other windows from the left and so on. So you have a couple of more options to arrange your workspace in this case. So let's close this again and make this a full screen note. So these are the different ways you can open notes uh, with the new split view. And what can you use it for? Um, one thing I use split view on the Mac all the time and now I can use it on the iPad as well. I always open um, after a release is done or if I want to review a full week, I open one node where I collect things like a backlog node on the left or on the right and the other node I use to switch between days. For example, we create a new node. Here it is already. So let's say backlog. And then you open um, the daily notes on the right. Oh, we're in, this, in the stage manager right now. Let me switch back. Okay, much better. And let's say you have here a couple of overdue tasks like from the past. And then what I like to do is, oh, okay. I collect these tasks in my backlog simply by I go through the days, review the tasks, decide if they're still important or not. And in this case, we can drag the task to the backlog or cut it out or whatever. Just move them from the days into another place where I can collect them. This is the advantage that you need to decide if the task is uh, um, still important. And if it's not important, you can just leave it in the day if you want. I know the overdue number here at the top will increase, which is also not the best way, but at least you reviewed your week, which is the important part. Or you can simply mark them as cancelled in the daily note 
uh, which will reduce your overdue counter and you can and you keep your important uh, tasks in in some node or you can drag them not in a backlog node but into a weekly node for example uh, and collect them for the next week or um, any week in the future so this is one use case uh, let's restore our original node and uh, the other one I showed you already is you can search for for something like you start a new project and you want now collect all the nodes which refer to this project which would be useful so you can open the search results again on the left and either open the nodes of the search on the right or let me show you another way let's open this backlog again in a split view instead of opening the results in a split view you can also copy the link to the node let's delete this one make a bullet point and paste them on the right so you can collect all your nodes which refer to some project let's say this is not backlog this is project XYZ and these would be all the relevant nodes and you can take um, additional bullet points on why this node is re relevant for this project and so on and simply copy all the nodes you need into this new node and collect them this way so these are two um, two of the use cases you can make use of the split view I'm sure there are many more and finally what's also this is and this comes in the new version and what's also new is you can drag things now in not just into days but also into the week so some task and let's drag this task you can drag th this task now into a day open the day and drag this task also into a week let's open this week and from this week we can copy or we can drag the task as well into other weeks you can go back a month go a month forward and so on and drag things between um, different weekly nodes between daily nodes and so on so you don't need to open the nodes cut and paste you can simply drag and drop and you can also drag and drop multiple tasks if you um, select them select them with the mouse you can select this and now if you start dragging in, in the selected area you can as well drag multiple things in one uh, batch okay that's all for now uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, I hope you learned something new and enjoyed this new version with the split view.